my Formula One work obviously is all is all about colour, razzmatazz, noise, um, rich guys. You know, everything's looking sparkly and, and gorgeous. What excites me about the type of photography that I'd like to do more of is a kind of a lack of a lack of humanity. I just like that kind of peaceful feeling of, of you know, that there's, there's evidence of humanity, but but without it. Concentrating particularly on things like urban decay and, and, and solitude, if you like, and, and um, it's, it's an incredibly hard thing to do. I, I try and work really hard at that. Uh, William Eggleston famously only takes one picture. I'm used to 65 laps on a Sunday afternoon, you know, and lots of practice sessions and, and qualifying sessions beforehand. If you, if you can get into a discipline of taking one shot and walking away, then I think that's ultimate respect really for that and if you can make that picture work and walk away. You don't have to have a pass around your neck, you don't have to have a sticker on your camera, you've not got dogs patrolling where you shouldn't go, you know, you can, you certainly, away from those restrictions and that security and that obsessive nature of, of control, which Formula One certainly is, this is the antithesis of that. You can, you can go wherever and do whatever you like to a point. I tried out and, and, and played with many different cameras, different styles of camera, different formats of camera, but always kept coming back to that wanting a Leica. You're buying into the legacy of people like Alfred Eisenstadt or Robert Capper or those people. I'm not comparing myself to those people, I would, I would never do that, but if, if a Leica was good enough for those guys, then it's good enough for me. When you're using a camera such as a Leica, it's, it's, you, you approach, or I certainly find myself approaching photography in a different way. I've started to use it at Formula One, particularly on Thursdays when it's a little bit calmer and when the cars aren't running. It's just, it's just nice, it's nice to have that, that single lens, that single body, and just to get on with doing what you're doing. I feel that the, the photography away from, from Formula One the off-track gallery, if you like, it does make me grow as a photographer. It's, it's something that I put a lot of thought into, and it's, it's through studying people at Eggleston's work, Kandar, Shaw's, Soth's work, that it, you look at the work that they've done, and it looks so easy. It just looks like pictures of, of a guy standing outside a truck stop in Midwest America. It looks like a, a bridge being built over the Yangtze River. It is such a hard thing to conquer, to, to be able to shoot that and make that interesting. It's just, it's difficult to, to do that and I, I put a lot of pressure on myself to try and get better at that, to think the better way, the simpler way to photograph it.